together we can show the world what we can do You are next to me and I'm next to you Push me on through until the battle's won No one's gonna give something to us Into each other we put our trust Standing united after the fight is done Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, the Ninja Fury, here. Time for another exciting review of Attack on Titan Season 3, Episode 5. Dun, 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 the Diager. Dun, 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 dun. Alright, enough of that. Well, I mean, still no high-quality Titan action coming your way, but hey, you know, at least, you know, yeah, anyway. So, here is the current status of this episode. So, what happens is, is that we all thought the worst was going to happen to Erwin with him actually getting executed, but no. Apparently, they're discussing exactly why, pretty much, you know, like... Well, well, he wanted to get his way out of it by discussing the the actual importances of the actual of Wall Maria and the fate of, like, what's going to happen, like... You know, of what's going to happen, you know... When the people actually learn the truth that the government is the one that's actually plotting something, and we were actually right on this whole thing. This whole King France, France guy, whatever the hell he is, yeah, this dude is fake. He's fake news. This dude is fake news, obviously, because you know, the, the way they just fooled me with this, I'm like, dude, this dude was just chilling. Like, 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 Matt, like yeah, like that, like, yo. Like, like, he was just chilling like this, like, you know, he just didn't really give a fuck, but... No, because I thought this dude was... Uh, I literally thought this dude was up to something. Like, I literally thought the King France guy... Like, I thought this dude was going to be on some top-tier shit. Like, this dude might be some, like, hidden, powerful titan or some shit. Or, or, like, whatever. That's what I thought. But, oh no, that's not what we got here indeed. Apparently, he's just some, like, old dude that is, like... Oh, uh, by the end of it, when they actually found out when they did their confession or whatever, because, you know, what was going to happen is, they, they basically, you know, violated anything of the actual, of the law, pretty much, saying, like, look, you know, many times we try to take Aaron from you, but, you know, you just wouldn't let us, and from the way of humanity of our court of rule of order, that's not how it's supposed to go down, but apparently, we got interruption from one of the other, sir, the, the, the scout, uh, the course members were basically they're like, hey, um, guess what? It was a, pretty much a distraction about, like, the actual, you know, like, oh, Wal Maria is being, like, the breach again by the Colossal Titan, um, or the Arm, no, I'm sorry, the Armor Titan. He's there, and he's wrecking havoc or whatever. And I thought this was the same thing, too, and I'm like, wait a minute, something seems a bit wrong here. Because I really thought at first that was really the case, how, basically, like, I really thought, oh, shit, are we actually going to see a Titan? Like, finally, after, like, five episodes, but, wow, no. So, as I figured something was wrong, it was a distraction they did, and they were playing this kind of strategy, and the strategy was pretty much going up against the law, and because of that, they finally got exposed from the truth. And they did, and that's pretty... I'm not gonna go over every single part of the, uh, the conversation in a nutshell, because I would go on and on and on and on. If I did that, that would be, like, way too boring. So, instead... I'm just here to condense it and shorten it up for you just for this review. So that's basically what really went down. And basically now that the confession has been made, like the truth has finally been revealed. So now that their actual punishment, like the actual, um, you know, like, um, like pretty much like the whole, the, the, the pretty much the actual, um, the art, the, the scouts themselves and the actual yeah so actually all of them no longer have to be in uh freezing uh, any kind of work or whatever they can actually go back and their sentence has been uh denied so now they don't have to worry they don't have to go into hiding anymore so they're finally free they don't have to worry about living life on the law anymore and stuff like that so yeah everything seems to be fine they don't have to go into hiding anymore and then what's really happening is that well i forget his name Xander, so I forget the dude's name, but basically, I'm gonna call him like Colonel Sanders. I don't fucking know. Like, this, uh, the higher ups, like, the sergeant dude, like, with glasses, he just comes in there, he basically just takes, um, Erwin, pretty much. Um, he just takes, uh, um, Erwin, he takes him, and basically, he was saying that, look, was this the right decision? Was I just thinking selfishly for myself? And said, all humanity, he's like, you know what? Maybe I sort of liked them, and maybe I didn't. But you know what? You're kind of like me. You don't give a shit about anyone else. As long as you're basically safe, 
And as long as you're basically, you know, you're safe, you're surviving, you're spreading the good word, who gives a shit what's going to happen to humanity at the end? And he's like, hmm, maybe you're pretty much right about that. Like, you're pretty much either it's good or bad, it doesn't really matter. We have to see exactly how it plays out. And it's like, okay, yeah. So, you're absolutely right on that. So, yeah, good timing. Good timing on that indeed. So, that was good. And then finally, at the end of the episode, we see... Aaron, finally, we have not seen him in, like, I don't know, like, an episode or two. So, finally, he's in this, like, cold, icy chamber. We have no idea what the hell it is. And apparently, it looks like, um, Hachi, she figured it out that it's some kind of ceremonial thing where he's going to get eaten and Aaron's going to die. And Aaron is going to get eaten. And then, um, then Arwen's like, wait a minute. I wonder what, what Aaron had to eat or who he had to consume to become the titan that he is now and that's pretty much where we end the episode off actually no no we don't because we have astoria and she's right there and it's like what in the flying fuck is going on like astoria is up to something and the preview it sort of looks like we're seeing aaron's dad in the preview and i'm like wait is that supposed to be aaron's dad i'm like oh shit that looks like aaron's dad so oh boy looks like we're gonna get more questions to our I mean, more answers to our questions that we've been asking. Where in the flying hell has Aaron's father had been all this time? And I think we're finally going to be seeing that in next week's episode. So, I'm actually really looking forward to that. Overall, when it comes to this episode, I really did like how everything was exposed from the truth and everything else. This is actually pretty good because I really did like the way how basically, like, everything was just pretty much exposed. The government, like, the lying bastard that they are, have finally been caught to, uh, to justice. So, yeah, overall, just a pretty good episode overall. That's all I gotta say. It's a pretty good episode. Animation, like always, was, as usual, very, very great. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below of this week's episode, or just this episode in general of Attack on Titan Season 3, Episode 5. I'll see you guys uh, next Sunday for episode uh six for season three what do you guys think comment me below if you love or hate the episode don't forget rate comment subscribe click on that bell join the squad boys follow my social media plugins and my gamer tags as well and also you know the plus ultra discord if you want to join the plus ultra discord so peace soul love chicken grease and the sky is the limit and my fans keep supporting rich me to what you watch and i'll catch you guys later